What's going on guys, it's Tremere and welcome back to another episode of RDR2 aka Red Dead Redemption 2. Sometimes I sort of fail to say Red Dead Redemption 2 so I'm just going to say RDR2 from now on. Also, this is mainly just like a tutorial on like how I get my money within Red Dead. I know some people struggle, uh, other people just like, you know, I'll just buy money on the game when there's no point in spending your actual real currency for in-game currency when it's it's actually quite easy to earn and I'm going to show you this way that I actually do it like for the past few games I've been getting ten dollars eleven dollars six dollars like and that all soon builds up because as soon as you play like 15 games with friends online you can have a very decent amount of money you can get you can probably get about two hundred and fifty dollars so let's get right into it. This game is one of the main game modes that I actually use to be able to get really good currency. It's called Spoils of War. For those of you that don't know what Spoils of War is, it's a game mode which you can actually just... It's like a capture the flag type objective thing where you've got to run around. You've got to use your weapons, but there are also weapons laying around. Some of the weapons are better than others you can have your own weapons like I said so if you have a very good weapon you will be able to pick people off very easy but the weapon I'm using at the minute I'm, I mainly have to go to for headshots because it's the starter rifle you actually get in fact I don't know I actually created the character a while ago so if I'm correct you don't get a rifle you only get a pistol so I actually bought this rifle with in-game currency that I was doing at the time and bear in mind there was no game modes at the time it was literally just running around and doing things for strangers that's the whole game at that point in time that's why I haven't really played the game but now they've brought out more things for the game and I hope this does prove helpful for you guys also if you guys won't be able to tell that these weapons that I am using I used one that I picked up the one that was actually sound very powerful and I actually got about ten dollars in this game as you can see and all I did was just shoot people I didn't do the objective or nothing so that's easy money there and if you're on the winning team I, I can't I haven't been on the winning team yet unfortunately but I assume that you actually do get a decent amount of money probably about twenty dollars twenty five dollars but just think every time you do that you'll get a good amount of money and it's just it's plain and simple this next gameplay is mainly just like of the races. Yeah, the one that I actually shown you originally, that one, it's it's my main income of the currency because if you come on the leading team, you do get about $25 because I've just had a little bit of research in between editing this. And well, this one you probably can get about $10, $15 if you first place. I'm not too sure as in the races. I'm not too bothered about the races as I prefer races in like Grand Theft Auto 5 where it's just cars the horses it's mainly just whether your horse has the stamina and it's more of a pay to win type of thing and what I mean by that is the better you have the better horse you have the more you spend on a horse the better it is yes that makes sense but within races there's people that's only just starting off they, they won't like them same as I don't yeah I might be able to like them further up on that line but in this current time the races I'll do them because I enjoy them but not as much as I enjoy Grand Theft Auto races if you know what I mean yeah Rockstar has done an amazing job with this game like it's such a good addition to Red Dead 1 I mean I didn't really play Red Dead 1 and I know that's gonna get so much hate but I, I didn't i I was more of the racing Gran Turismo kind of guy. I've got Gran Turismo on the PlayStation, but I was more of a Gran Turismo kind of guy. Forza, uh, you name it. I was into everything. Rally, mostly cars. Uh, but the one thing I do like with this is like the actions that your characters do. Like your characters start doing flips, and <laughs> it's just it's hilarious when you're with a bunch of mates and everybody's just flying. The horses are flying, and you just don't know what's going off. Right guys, this is literally just like the standard version of a race where you get certain checkpoints, you have to get to them in a chronological order, like it's not random like the free mode one you just watched. This one, it's mainly just getting to the end first, that's, I don't know what else I can say about a race. And one thing I have 
just noticed about this as well that I do like is the fact that you can actually hit each other and like you can discourage each other's horses but you have to try and not die update from uh, just then I have sort of run out of content for that matter of hints and tips and shenanigans as they are the mo they are the top three most things I actually use to get currency of the game and also I am currently on like seven dollars ninety cents bounty on my head so if somebody does manage to kill me in this village they'll get roared a little bit and I've also got a new horse I don't know if you guys saw my old horse not sure if he, I released her her name was Betsy she she was very loyal in every single way but I've got a new horse and she needs to come right now see my favorite types of horses are the ones that look like cows a brown and white so guess what horse I got I've got a brown and white horse yes hi You know, I'm actually going to try and, like, put someone on the back of the horse. I'm not sure. Lol Gamer 1611. No! 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 He's, he's doing what I wanted to do to him! No way! No! No! Wow. Wow. Boom, got someone. Yes! Yes! I've managed to do it. Right. We actually did it. We have found somebody. Ah. It's not fun. Hey. Yeah. I'm supreme. <laughs> right. So. Gonna try and run. Are they, are they giving up? Or are they gonna wiggle out? We'll see. Ah! Oh damn! <laughs> Ooh. In fact, I will show you guys one more way that I actually do get money from. Um, depending on how many you get if it's actually worth it so ah oh, it's coyote let's get it yay <laughs> <laughs> sort of dancing there. So, we're actually skinning the hair. Skinning it. Boom. Yeah, you do use your bullets this way, and I'm pretty sure you guys know, but no. What I'm doing by now. So, skin this deer. Ew. Ew. Poor deer pelt. And meat. Boom, got it. Let's just see how much this goes for. As I'm not too sure actually. Look. Ah, but it just feels used. <laughs> One 
for the road. I hear a steam train. Oh my god. It's like he just pulled a sock off his foot. So, actually put, we'll actually park her here, Bell, here. And actually show you guys now how much you can actually sell the lot for. So that's that's literally all I got was there. You actually got five dollars for that. Five dollars sixty six cents just for that. Like that's as quick as actually going in like the one of the races and then coming seventh. Which and you had a bit more fun doing that as well because uh, I promise I'm not a psychopath anymore. But that was pretty fun just to skin him there. And then, yeah, you can come with me. Yeah. Oh, you did now. Let me uh, give you a quick clean. Yeah, let me let me let me give you a. Uh, Quick, quick, clean. You're too important to my plans. Oh, Jesus! I nearly went down. I mean, what? No. Um, we're sitting on here for a, for a little break from society. We're uh, lovers stargazing. I mean, look how nice this view is. Oh my god, it actually worked. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, I did. Hi. Yeah, I like you. <laughs> you know what, Sheriff? I'm sick of you. Always saying that you can do things to me. Hey! Your life's in my hands. You call me that? You're dead. You hear me? You are dead. D E A D. Dead Amundo. See you later, Sheriff. Um. If you guys did enjoy this episode, then please let me know by leaving a comment in the comment section. All comments are appreciated on this channel good or bad I'll reply to every single one like I have been doing and I would like to thank Doc Britton for the suggestion to Red Dead 2 as he is communicating with me and it's great that I can actually communicate with people outside my social area and if you guys do want any games also let me know like Doc Britton did because he actually suggested Red Dead 2 if you didn't watch the episode it's in the description down below top line and if you guys wouldn't mind hitting that red subscribe button or smashing that like button as that allows me to know you guys want me to load on a daily. Plus go to xpboost.stores, the most reliable way to get gaming fuel. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.